the North Steam Academy. We'd love to share our journey with you. STEAM education is basically an educational approach to learning that uses science, technology, engineering, arts, and mathematics for guiding student inquiry, dialogue, critical thinking, and problem solving. The end result that we're looking at is that we're producing students who are taking thoughtful risk, are engaging in hands-on learning, persisting in problem solving, and also being able to embrace collaboration and communication through a very creative process where there's not just one right way or always one right answer. These are also the innovators, the educators, leaders, and learners of the 21st century. The staff at North Elementary was really excited to be given the opportunity to make this journey this year to become a STEAM Academy. We are just now laying our foundation. We have a lot of learning to go and a lot of things each year that we hope to layer in for the STEAM education for our students. STEAM education really involves the science, technology, engineering, and art and math into the curriculum. And it's not just based about it being individualized, but it's all incorporated into every content area. To us, STEAM education involves a lot of problem solving, a lot of critical thinking. Um, it's a structured way of thinking through a process, and it can be used multidisciplinary in all subjects. Learning to take risks, solve problems, and overcome frustration and failure are real life, real world skills that our students need. I think design learning is really important for our students because it's really a change of mindset for them. They're very used to just seeing things one way, and especially with our EIE unit that we've had, a lot of my students failed a lot, and that wasn't common for them, and so they had to fail to improve and then they got really excited when their windmills finally did work, that that design process thinking really showed that it's okay if I don't do something correctly the first time because I'll keep working at it. Problem-based learning forces them to think outside the box and helps them uh, work collaboratively in groups and think about other ideas that those kiddos are presenting to their team. I believe that STEAM has really changed our lesson planning because we really truly design it backwards. We start with the end in mind and we have an end goal for the students that we want for them to reach and then we plan along the way what misconceptions they'll see and how we can work and improve upon it. We're really excited about North becoming a STEAM Academy um, because we feel like our students will be more engaged and we're going to have critical thinkers for um, jobs that aren't even created yet. Ready for the future. Our students have really responded to STEAM learning this year. One of the clubs or one of the things that we work on is the robotics. I just worked with some students for coding. They were so excited to share. They knew so much more that I could even teach. And that's, that's kind of the beauty of STEAM. My students have really responded to STEAM learning this year by really learning how to fail and fail correctly. So that way they can improve upon their failures. And once they have succeeded, they really showed that they can overcome those obstacles no matter what. Um, I think our students have responded very, very well. They love having the tangible um, items that they're creating, especially in the EIE units. Uh, we, they love the we have a parachute unit, and so they're beginning to build their own parachutes and then test uh, how the parachutes work, and there's different variables that they're presented with. You know, one of the other things that um, the kids really like is that we're pulling a lot more technology into it. You know, that's the T part. North Elementary was uh, recommended to me by my uh, sister-in-law and of course when we moved someplace we just got out of the military so uh, wanted a good school for our, uh, our daughter and uh, she recommended very highly. Once I got here I realized that uh, the staff and the teachers and the principal everyone really really cares about these kids, their education, and they want to make them the, uh, the best young people they can be. My family and I feel that we didn't choose North Elementary, North Elementary chose us. We initially enrolled in White Settlement ISD with the intention of transferring him to another school after his first year. However, we were not prepared for how in love we fell with the school, the staff, the principal, all the programs and the curriculum that they had to offer. The reason I chose North is actually because we lived in the district, but two years ago we moved out of the district and chose to keep him at North because it's such a good school. There's been continual changes in the school for better and have been seeing a transition to just different things, including the STEAM Academy. Every day there's something new that he's been exposed to that he's in the third grade, but my husband and I were exposed to it in college. So we're just trying to figure out how we're going to stay caught up to him at this point. Uh, we feel that North is a great place for any student, and it is the perfect place for our students. 
but it's top notch. They have care, uh, teachers that really care about their students uh, and they really, really want to get involved and not only teach them what they require, but teach them above and beyond, teach them to be good people and also teach them to uh, expand their minds to search and make connections with what's interesting to them and how that applies to uh, the educational concepts that they're learning in school. So you should have seen my face when my third grader Lucy came home and told me that she was coding. I barely know what that is and she's already creating software. And she's not just creating software but physical things that they're making in the classroom. Working in teams, designing. I like most of the trivia company is Deep Academy because when I was younger I wanted to be an engineer. It was challenging yet super fun and I really learned something. I always wish that we had something new in our playground and we get to create something new from our minds. We got to take out of stuff that we thought of off of the paper and we got to actually create it and it was fun and educational at the same time. That like if you're building something outside like a birdhouse, you, you, you think of the design process and you can figure out how to do it. It involved and offering something new and unique in our